Welcome to Module 3 of the GI Springboard Program. In this module, we'll explore how to use social media and specifically Facebook to grow your practice. Module 3 is focused on the attract traffic element of the perfect patient life cycle. And we're focusing on social media because of its massive potential to connect with people in today's world. The social media revolution has brought about sweeping changes to culture over the last decade. Facebook launched beyond college campuses in 2005. Twitter came on the scene in 2006. LinkedIn has actually been around since 2003. Pinterest, the fastest growing social media channel ever, launched in 2010. These sites all have one thing in common. They are putting a large amount of power and control in the hands of users and allowing them to interact directly with each other. No longer was the internet just a source of information. It was now a place to connect, to share, to communicate. This radical shift in the way people in our culture connect and communicate has changed the way we make decisions too. In 2012, Search Engine Land reported that 72% of consumers trust online reviews as much as they trust personal recommendations. The goal of marketing efforts shifted from simple word of mouth which has always been the holy grail of marketing, to digital word of mouth. All types of organizations were asking the same question. How do we get people to talk about us to their social networks? We'll begin to answer that question for you in this module of Springboard. By focusing specifically on Facebook, we'll give you practical tips and tools to engage with patients and potential patients through social media so that you can leverage the power of digital word of mouth to grow your practice. With over 1.1 billion active users worldwide, Facebook is currently the largest social media network by a wide margin. The first step toward engaging patients and potential patients with social media is to launch a page for your practice on Facebook. We've included a dive-in tool in this module to walk you step-by-step -step through the process of doing that. And that same tool includes five things you must do to use your Facebook page to drive patients to your practice. One of the most recent changes in Facebook is that for organizations, it has basically become a pay-to-play environment, meaning that in order to get the most out of your interactions there, you will need to invest a small amount of money every month to see good results. The power of marketing on Facebook, though, is the laser-like targeting that is available. You can set up your Facebook ads and promoted posts so that only people that fit your specific parameters, things like age, location, or other lifestyle factors, will see your ads. In another dive-in tool in Module 3, we'll show you how to use Facebook ads to increase your Facebook audience and drive patients to your website. This tool even includes 12 done-for-you ads that you can start using today on Facebook. The final piece of Module 3 is an ebook called Understanding HIPAA and Social Media. In it, you'll find practical tips and sample policies for making sure that your social media interactions remain HIPAA compliant. Start using the Dive In tools and watch your online audience grow. Before you know it, you'll be seeing new patients that found you through Facebook. Now that's the power of Springboard.